everyone so this is a very quick video for you today um i shared a set of nails the other day and people have been asking what was on my nails um, and i hadn't videoed them so i thought i'd just do a quick video of how i created those nails for you all so um i'm working on elsa again obviously and i've applied a thin clear base i'm then coming in and i'm using pastels and these are all pastel colors from hazel dixon and I'm coming in first of all with this lovely yellow and I'm just applying that by the cuticle area and blending down. I've got about five colours out on the desk so I'm then coming in and I'm picking up two of the colours. So I've gone for the yellow and that lilac and then a tiny bit of black and then I'm just going to swirl back and forth in a marble. So I don't want to over swirl it so it just becomes a big brown smudge. And then I'm coming in with two other colours. And again coming in with the black and i just keep doing this down the nail and this is how i had done the nails previously on my um, other set that people have been asking about so i just do two different colors i just make sure you get a nice blend between all the additions and i just randomly pick them up as i felt like it uh, my brush just fell where i let you know just fell where it wanted um, and i just keep working down the entire nail until i've got a full nail of marble And then when the marble is all completed, I'm then going to cap that nail in clear acrylic. And this is when I make sure that I get the correct shape and structure to my nail. Then on to the next nail, I've already applied the thin clear base and then coming in with a bit of CJP birthday suit and applying this on the nail bed. I always, I tend to do this because I don't really like clear with like a natural nail bed showing through so I always like to put, even if it's just a thin base like this, it will just even out um, any imperfections on a natural nail bed. I'm then going to come in with one of the VIP glitters from the Glitter Fairy. This was one of the April ones. Um, and then going to do this kind of in my usual swoosh across and then down to the tip um, but I'm going to leave it a relatively crystal tip so I want the glitter quite sparsely spaced out there. So it's one of those designs that you can pretty much use any glitter you like. I think in my nails that I was actually wearing, I put some shards in too. I'm then coming in with, this is one of my cloudy whites that I've mixed. So this is 
I think, three parts clear and one part natural white. So you get, this is good for like milk bath nails and things like that because you get that nice cloudy look to it. And then bringing that down the nail and then just blending it out so that again we'll have that nice crystal clear tip but there's a bit of kind of smoky white to the top half of the nail. And then once I'm happy with um, application and everything on there, I'm then going to cap this nail in clear acrylic. Um, for the set I wore, I did the two middle names, nails the same as this, and then the outside nails and the thumb in the marble. Because I just wanted to do a quick video, I've literally just done these two nails on these tips for you, just to show you how I created that design. I'm going to file in those nails. Um, it's really weird filing in on this practice hand because they jiggle about and I have to keep pushing them back in. Uh, <laughs> so sorry about that. But yeah, I've just included the filing here as well. Make sure, especially when you're working with a stiletto, make sure you keep looking at it from lots of different angles. You've got to make sure you're keeping that nice and straight and always support that nail as you file the length of it because you just don't want to snap the end off. Um, as someone who does stilettos quite a lot, it is so infuriating when you snap the end off. Oh, and you have to start again. So I'm just going to file that into a nice point. You can always round off the tip of your stiletto. It depends how wearable you want to make it. And then I'm going to top coat those nails. And then they're all finished. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you all again soon. Bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video guys if you want to see more like this remember to head on over to my channel click the subscribe button and make that bell ring and then you'll get notifications every time i share a new video thanks for tuning in bye